afternoon and welcome back to southwest france it is absolutely scorching out here um i'll just give you a, a quick look at what i've been uh, up to in the bedroom so uh, it has been uh, it has been stiflingly hot um yeah the thing about having a fireplace in um in a bedroom is that i said like this in the i said this in the winter it's like having an open window and uh, yeah it is like 32 degrees which is what 90 fahrenheit outside so yeah a lot of that heat is just coming in through the chimney so not pleasant to be uh, working inside or outside today uh yeah so i'm uh, i'm busy uh filling these walls with um fiberglass insulation and uh, it's going okay actually it's been a bit of a faff up in that corner that's the back of the um uh the fuse cupboard uh, i've got a cupboard you know in the corner of the hall the old hallway where the uh, electric meter is and uh, i had to um yeah, it was a bit of a faff the um fuse uh, fuse box was screwed to i think it's like three quarter plywood um but it was screwed up against the back the back face of the wall so that plywood is actually screwed directly to that three quarter plywood so there was no space for a cavity there was no cavity so I had to move it, uh, move it in, so to create a cavity to um, put in insulation. So I've done that, really pleased. So that back wall's done. Um, and uh, yeah, I've got to, well, I've got to about here, and I'm just about to start that row there. So yeah, it's a bit of a faff, but I'm really glad I'm doing it. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm, uh, that's what I'm working on right now. Uh, I haven't touched that up there. I still need to um, get some screws and wood. Hopefully I will get those tomorrow. Uh, yeah, got a, quite a busy day tomorrow, so hopefully I'll get time to do it. So I've just sorted out uh, some alpha, alpha for Dave. So we'll have a little wander down and have a little chat. So this video, has got a sponsor and there's a very good reason why this why this video has got a sponsor um if you've been watching my channel for a while you know that i don't do uh corporate sponsorship uh very often uh I, you know i'll only uh promote something if i genuinely believe it's good and helpful to me personally you know you won't find me um advertising insurance but um do you remember it was back in april um and I had a bit of a, a bit of a situation. My uh, glasses that I was wearing uh, fell to pieces. And uh, put that up there for a second. And uh, yeah, I was in a bit of a pickle because um, I needed some uh, new frames uh, for my lenses and uh, quite expensive lenses I had uh, in these glasses. And uh, so anyway, I was looking around trying to find an opticians in France. And opticians in France don't work quite like they do in the uk it's more of a retail business in the uk whereas here it's a healthcare business so um anyway yeah looked around didn't really get anywhere i was kind of told to go to the doctor to get a referral so i can get an appointment to get an eye test and then you go somewhere to get your glasses made a bit of a palaver and it's not that long since i had an eye test so i had a recent eye test uh, certificate and then so i thought well what i'll do is um I'll try and find some new frames for these glasses, uh, for these lenses. And, uh, well, that wasn't quite as easy as I thought. Um, and then someone suggested, brilliantly, try and buy a new pair of frames that I already had. So, yeah, take the model number, do a bit of searching around, uh, and see if you can buy those frames. And uh, absolute genius idea. So, uh, yeah, I went back to where I bought them and to find out, some information about them because the information had rubbed off on the actual glasses on the frames and i found a pair of frames x display frames so new but x display uh, on on ebay and uh yeah this guy sent them to me fantastic so what i sat i sat down and did i i took the lenses out of my glasses and tried to fit them into my new frames and they were just a little bit different just a little bit different and uh so yeah i was kind of in a pickle so what i had is a brand new pair of frames which i'd paid for and lenses that didn't fit in them so what i thought i'd do <laughs> is see if i could find somewhere in france that would reglaze them 
and uh, no <laughs> and I found a company in Poland and I found a company in Germany and they would have cost me over 200 pounds both of them to um, to uh, send my frames to them for them to put new lenses in because these are transitions lenses uh, they, they change from clear to like sunglasses as you can see and um, so yeah just searching around searching around and I found a company and a company are called glasses to you and they are fantastic absolutely fantastic not only are they fantastic they're cheap and so um, yeah I've, I can't rate them highly enough um, you go on their website and uh, you type in your prescription you send them your frames or you buy new glasses if you, you know they do sell frames um, and they let you know when they receive your frames by email and then you wait a week or so and then they email you to say your glasses are ready and they're being sent back to you I mean, it's the easiest thing in the world all i had to do was i had to pay an import tax because uh we're not in uh, we're not in the eu anymore are we uh, this is a, a british company and uh say hello yeah i think i think you just did say hello didn't you um yeah uh glasses to you are based in britain and uh, obviously I'm in France. So yeah, you do have to pay import duty, but even that was easy. I got an email uh, from La Post and it says, click here to pay your import duty. And I did click there, filled in my um, credit card details and paid the small import duty. And I think it was two days later on a Saturday, my glasses were delivered in a new case with a cloth and they are fantastic and i'm wearing them now and some people didn't realize that i'm wearing new glasses i know someone did though because they they thought they looked good so uh yeah i can't rate glasses to you highly enough honestly uh, and i will be placing an order for another pair of glasses um this week so uh yeah have to have to keep an eye out for those when i uh, when i put them on um so i think if you uh, go onto their website today and you register uh, they'll send you uh, a voucher or a code for 30 percent off your first order which if you look at how cheap the glasses are on their website absolutely fantastic and they ship worldwide and if you spend more than 100 pounds for nothing free free shipping worldwide i mean the, f the firm is just fantastic absolutely top draw so um yeah i don't do sponsorships very often but um yeah i thoroughly i thoroughly recommend this company so anyway right come down and see dave i'll give him some alfalfa and uh he's very expectantly it's a bit early though isn't it really it's a bit early for treats um, but it is hot isn't it hey eh? it is stiflingly hot out here so uh, let's give him his alfalfa here we go fella no no kicking me today all right no silly games oh dear oh dear You lunatic. So uh, I came down to see him a little bit earlier actually.
anyway, I'm uh, a busy boy tomorrow, uh, so I think I'll probably upload this video on Friday and then uh, it'll give you something to watch over the weekend and uh, I'll be back in a few days. See you later.